And it's totally possible before we get to Rogue Legacy, before we get to noon, that is, I may uh, switch over to something else. I don't know that I'm going to be able to to stick with Shin Megami Tensei for that whole time as much as I love it. <laughs> I, and I do. I do love it, guys. I promise. Does it ever get into the kind of story stuff at all that Persona has? No, not to the level Persona does at all. No. Mm. Uh, no, it's it's. I mean, like the Nocturne is a lot less story heavy than Persona. There's definitely story. There's stuff that happens, and there's some some interesting twists here and there from what I've played. But uh, it's a lot less often. You don't get like lengthy like, you know, an hour of gameplay where it's pretty much all just dialogue. All right. So, you played Duke Persona 4 multiple times, I assume. Yeah. You played this. Have you played any other SMT games? Um, I, I mean, I've played Persona 3. Um, I, I guess I've played a little bit of Persona 1 and Persona 2. Uh, oh, uh, Shin Megami Tensei Strange Journey on DS. Oh, right. Um, which is fucking awesome. Really, really, really like that game. Definitely a highly recommended one. If you're looking for uh, a game that has like the old school Shin Megami Tensei feel, but definitely has some like modern improvements as well, um, Strange Journey is great. What is this thing? I want it on. Oh no! Whoops! I ran away instead of talking to it by accident. Well, it's toilet paper. Uh, Kion Coach says, I don't like the stories of the modern Persona games much. That is weird. You're weird. <laughs> You're weird. Well, you heard it here first. If we're talking about modern Persona games, I assume that's 3 and 4. Yeah. Because 1 and 2 were just significantly different. Though. Yes. I, I, I like the stories of the old Persona games as well. I, they're obviously a lot, as games, a lot less approachable. Just a constant, uh, I can just hear your AC constantly now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I think my room is cool enough. <laughs> I don't blame you. I mean, it's it's been super hot here, so I, I understand yeah. this. Oh, well, I mean, <laughs> I used to do a lot of podcasting, and... You know, it's, it was really hard to try to, like, get a recording done when the AC's on like that. And it sucked, because it was, like, an hour of just being in, like, a sauna, because I have, like, so many things running in here. Which I should probably turn off. I'm kind of burning energy. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Yay! I got the toilet paper thing to join my party. Sweet. You gotta pay him. I paid him a little bit. Who are you gonna replace? Well, I'm gonna... Let me... Let me check out their... Their different stats here. Might just sit on the sidelines for right now. So, can you rename hmm. these demons, or whatever the heck they're called, Pokemons? Yeah, they're Pokemons. That's, you You got it. Yeah, but can you rename them? Uh, no, I don't think so. Really? Wow. Not that I know of, anyways. Maybe you can, and I just don't know. <laughs> so, how do we get Kyle back in the call? I am trying so hard, and by so hard, I'm just like clicking three buttons, and it's not letting me do it. Whether it is, it's just can they right-click on his name and then call? 
Um, I mean, I'm trying to add him to call, but okay. every time I try to, it says it's either busy or not answering. Hmm. So... If you guys want Kyle back on the call, donate, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Only with the power of donation will be will we be able to get Kyle back in. Yeah, right. It all is that you just drag his name into the chat. You get you just drag his name. You drag I, his name into. The... I will drag his thing into the chat or not chat, but call. Hmm. Not working. Yep. It's just... <laughs> Bro, can Are we you... call that a Doom clone checks class? Because it's just reskin Doom, isn't it? Just a... It is literally a Doom clone in the sense that it was made in the Doom engine. Yeah. I'm gonna try calling Kyle one more time, even though I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> it's, yeah. Oh, hey, that guy learned here as well. We are trying so hard to get Kyle in here. And it's just... Kyle can't be added until they accept your contact request. Okay. Yep. <laughs> so it's his fault as usual. Yeah. I, I sent my request. It's it's two way street, buddy. So you're just kind of running around, unlocking doors. Yeah. Getting through this place. Yeah. Leveling up. Mm hmm. Catching monsters. You gotta catch them all. <laughs> Obviously. I'm just filling out the map at this point. Yeah, it is, uh, we're, we're getting to boss time. We're gonna be fighting that boss very soon. What? <laughs> yeah, it just says Kyle can't be added until they accept Kong But it looks Kong. like he did. Like, he says, it shows his online for me. Alright, well, let's see. Click, drag, and call failed. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Let me try talking to this lady here, talk some sense into her. Well, I guess I could do this. Well, I will say this. I mean, I assume he has an iPhone, because he mentioned it earlier. I remember the Skype, like, iOS app is, like, really bad. It just never cooperates with you. Laminil, li, Laminil, something like that. In the chat says this game is so incredibly Persona. Technically, Persona is so incredibly this game. If you want to be for real about it. It's Persona Pokemon Edition. Sorry, see it. <laughs> so social links, you have um, monsters to raise. So I'm going to keep this one out of my party for now, but I think later on she's going to be good. <laughs> we have somebody who can cast fire now, at least, so that's that's always a plus. Alright, boss fight, let's do this. 
Llama NL is how it's pronounced, apparently. My apologies, Can you... Lominal. Can you recruit <laughs> bosses? <laughs> What's that? Can you recruit bosses? Uh, no, I don't. I don't believe so. I think oh. there are some some demons that you fight where like after I think that's how it is with Dante is like you fight Dante at some point and then after you beat him he's like ah oh, well I guess I'll join you. Right. I think that's just a special case. Or something. Yeah, it's you is this guy's weakness, so that's good. Yeah, it's a good thing we didn't put that fire lady in because I think she would have been weak too to that attack. And call <laughs> failed again. What? Oh, we keep trying to add him, but it just it just fails every I don't time. Know, whatever, man. Yeah, we yeah. tried. He must have done something with his PC. Because that did sound pretty abrupt when he mentioned the whole thing. It's like, hey, I can't use my PC anymore, or whatever. I think he just wanted to be lazy and, like, be away from his PC. <laughs> That's what you get, I guess, for being lazy. I feel like for a first boss fight, this is going distressingly well. Yeah, it looks like you have it all under control. I love that little gingerbread dude. He's, he's pretty great. <laughs> yeah. He just kind of floats around. critical hits because he's paralyzed. God damn. He's got a lot of health. Just fucking rocked that guy. Did you even uh, get an attack in? Bazpool16 in the chat says, is this a roguelike? Nope. <laughs> not, not at all. But you can die as if it was a roguelike, right? <laughs> Cheap sudden deaths or whatever. Yeah, you can get like cheap sudden deaths, but you're, you know, there's saved games and stuff. You're not going to lose all of your. You're going to lose your progress from the last time up to the last time you saved. Right. Um. Let's do another one in Vitality. That seems like it's never a bad idea. You know, it might be better if it was a roguelike, because then at least there'd be an excuse for everything looking the same. <laughs> here soon we're out of yeah i'm hoping after killing that boss you'll get out of this hospital okay. why what is that why is that happening that, that is not me brad why what what did i do i heard loud mic shaking yeah. oh sorry uh, are you falling asleep? <laughs> uh, the Cheese 33 is wondering when the indie horror art block will be put on the Twitch page. Um, that didn't happen, so... Yeah, involved. that didn't happen. Uh, they, uh, Austin decided to do Monaco instead. There were a lot of people that were disappointed by that, but Monaco was a fun, you know, was a fun watch. People enjoyed it, at least. Monaco is a horror of its own type. Yeah. I can barely tell what's going on when I'm playing it. <laughs> I haven't even touched it, but it looks really interesting. No, I don't think anyone was named Lolita Lolly Lolly.
am so not immersed in this game right now. <laughs> I'm trying to kind of understand what's going on, but... Brad, you wouldn't be immersed in this game no matter what. Oh, well, I like damn. Persona 3 and 4. <laughs> those are cool. I Those are very different than SMT. Like, the main SMT games are much more about the gameplay. Like, the RPG gameplay. Yeah, I think that's the worst part of Persona. And I, I mean, yeah. you're wrong. You're allowed to be wrong about everything. <laughs> like, Persona 4's fucking combat system is brilliant. I, I don't know, Phil. If you took all the social links, what would Persona be? No, the social links <laughs> are part of why it's brilliant. That's why, but I'm like, they connect to the combat. And how they connect to the combat is fucking awesome. Oh god, why am I back in here? Leave, leave, leave. <laughs> Uh, Bazbull16 says Persona is a Chex Quest clone and is correct. Okay, so we're just on the world map now. Oh god, what are these? <laughs> Wait, there's Ren Wow, okay. <laughs> Wing buffet. Oh man, I could go for a wing buffet right now. You and your bonus wings. It's pronounced Buffet. <laughs> Gross. God, why? Brad, Brad stop that! <laughs> what are you keep doing? I just keep scratching my face. Please stop! Just, yeah, I'll stop now. <laughs> or just mute your mic when you do. Oh god. That's the worst, most terrifying thing. It sounds like <laughs> it sounds like the end of the world is happening on your end of the call. Oh, it could be. Um, I need to go back in here and fucking heal up, because that... These guys are higher level than I am. <laughs> oh hey, the Wario bot is back. Unless he's actually back back. Could be both. Maybe a little of both. Wario is so nice making that bot for us. I appreciate yeah. that. And uh, that's a good reminder. Let everyone know. Remind everybody. Uh, this is a good game. Charity streamathon event. We're trying to uh, collect money for for uh, Boston's One Fund, which <laughs> goes toward the um, victims of the Boston Marathon bombing. So if you are able to contribute, please do. A dollar helps. Every dollar. Yeah, every dollar helps. The more the better, so I, though. I thought I heard that you almost called this stream philanthropy. Jesus Christ. No. <sighs> Why? There is, like, at no point was that going to be called that. Why not? Because that is a fucking terrible name. How is it oh, terrible? It it's perfect. No, I'm not going to name a fucking charity stream after myself. <laughs> Well, someone someone else suggested it. It's not like you came up with the name. That, that makes it happen. That literally does not matter to me at all. There's nothing narcissistic. I would have about sooner. It. I would have sooner canceled the stream <laughs> than they did that. I don't know. I'd be a lot happier right now. I, I like that. Janine's suggestion of that Doctor Robotnik thingy, just because it's long and nice. <laughs> well, I already say that. Brad, it's happening again. Why? <laughs> Is it? Okay, that's not me. Yeah. No, it's it's you. Cause it can't be me. It might. I be don't know Phil. why that's happening. No, it can't be Phil. Cause he's complaining about it. Yeah, it's not me. It can't I'm be me. It. Yeah, cause I'm hearing it. Brad's the only one who's not hearing it. it or maybe to... it's the ghost of Kyle. No, he's haunting <laughs> us. 